Hey, what's up guys, this is Dorian. So what am I doing? Well, I know my video output has dropped a little bit lately and to be honest, it's summertime, weekends are super busy. I've been gone almost every weekend, so it's been a lot harder to get things done. And also this heat that we've been having in Canada of all places is just killing me. So when I want to, you know, sit down in my little room and work and it is just hot. Um, I don't have air conditioning. So when it's 33, 34 degrees Celsius, sitting in a room upstairs with the window closed because the traffic is loud outside, it kind of sucks. I, I talked about this a couple of weeks ago too, but you know what? This is super, super hot. But anyways, I am working on stuff but it's stuff that's going to increase the productivity of my channel. Uh, I'm video editing here. This is actually a video that I've already uploaded it. Uh, I've just loaded it here just to show you guys what kind of stuff that I do here. So a lot of editing, a lot of cutting and adding different things, adding music. I have tons and tons of music from Andreas, who's a really awesome guy, aka Mr. Gamer. All the background music that you hear in my videos are his, and all the outro music are all his. So I have tons of his music that I'm, I go through. And the issue is, especially for really long videos, this one isn't that bad. It's not super, super long. But when I have, you know, a 25 minute video and I have all these songs, I have to go in here and I have to manually keyframe everything. Can I just zoom this in here? You're going to see it. Yeah. So I have to manually keyframe the different volumes. So you could see here how, where it says 30, 31, 21, right? Like the decibel level changes. I don't know if you can make that out that it's changing, but anyways, I have to set the volume for the songs. He's working with me too. He's super awesome. He's super motivated to get this stuff done too. And so big shout out to you, Andreas, you're awesome. And so we're working on having all these songs normalized so that they're the same volume levels so that I don't have to manually do this every time, different volume levels. Some songs have a little bit of a louder part. So I go in and have to change that one part to make it a little quieter. But you know what, the background music, as long as it's not too loud, uh, I really, really like background music and videos instead of just dead silence. And not only that, but it also muffles out other stuff that's going on in my house. If, you know, my wife is watching TV or talking on the phone or the cats are outside my office door crying, the you can barely hear it in the audio, but with that little bit of background music, it muffles it out. So this is going to be a time saver for me for sure. And also at the end of my videos, I'm sure you've noticed I'll always have um, some kind of one of Andreas's songs that you know really have a good beat that like breaks in right at the right time. Um, so I don't know, you guys gonna hear this? Uh, no, right, all right. Right. So as soon as I'm done talking, some cool part kicks in. Right. So. That, that's the kind of stuff that I'm working on and I you know zoom it right in and I have the volume change at the right times as soon as I'm done talking right when the good part kicks in and I'm doing this stuff manually every time so what I'm doing now is I'm finding all those good songs that have that part that I want at the ending and I'm going to render the song like this so that it will it'll just be one of the outros that way it's recorded at that volume, it's recorded like that, it's already set, so I basically just drop it in, line it up to when I stop talking, and boom, everything's done. So a lot of time-saving things that I'm trying to do, and the outro boards for my videos, like you know these things here, um, just different ways that I'm trying to optimize my time on editing and stuff afterwards so that I can basically go from recording something 
to a much faster edit and an upload because sometimes sometimes I get stuff out the same day sometimes I don't I try to but it's never a guarantee some some of the videos are quite long uh, what would I have it's long so yeah this one was 20 minutes but this editing actually wasn't too bad but you know all these songs have to be manually um, manually tuned to the right volume and that's another thing too right like I have to if it's a 20 minute video I have to listen to the whole 20 minute video and make sure that it sounds okay and then I render it to whatever file format I'm gonna upload to YouTube and then I listen to it again and YouTube tends to sometimes mess around with your audio a little bit so I'll upload it to YouTube now I won't publish it yet and then I'll listen to it streaming over YouTube again and then I will add my end screens and whatever and then I will um, finally publish it so uh, let's see use placeholders what is this yep okay modified yeah this one this one was a bit longer this was almost 45 minutes so a lot more editing right so this 45 minute video on elementary I had to listen to it at least three times so what's that hour and a half two hours and 15 minutes of just re-listening to it so because I, I can listen to the individual parts and whatnot and that's fine um, but there are some parts that are louder so I'm like okay I'll lower it and then I want to hear the other parts well did I lower it too much for the other parts do I have to now put in some keyframes to change it just lots of tweaking trying to make um, much better quality videos nice transitions and nice editing and everything so it takes a little bit of effort and that's what I'm trying to improve that's the time I'm trying to cut down on and um, yeah just be more efficient at putting this stuff out on YouTube for you guys and less work for me in the end really so I'm doing all the harder work now to benefit me in the end so anyways speaking of transitions there's one of them uh, i'm gonna thank all you guys my patreon patrons carlos arknos carl george matt kit and says i'm not saying last names now but i kind of want to because that's what i'm used to but anyways thank you guys so much for contributing to my channel and helping me contribute to the linux community if you guys would like to contribute please head over to patreon.com slash dorian dot slash or head over to the PayPal link in the description for a one-time donation. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to share on social media. Thanks a lot for watching, and until next time, bash on.